Okay, so with a slight delay, we can start now, hopefully. And I would like to show you just, um, hello, good morning, finally we are here. I would like to start with just a few remarks about the institution so you know where you are, although mostly mentally. Central European Forum is a part of Olomouc Museum of Art, a state-funded institution. It was established around 20 years ago and the idea was to connect Central Europe as such. I'll deal with it later. Uh, we've uh, managed to build a collection. Uh, you can meet here Štěpanka Bilašova, who was uh, a leader there of the institution, so it was main, uh, mainly her responsibility. Here you can see Abakanovich, for example, we've built permanent exhibition, uh, which you can see also upstairs, and probably you did um, before, uh, which is only partially presenting the collection itself. We've published quite a lot of books uh, covering modernistic art out of the second half of 20th century, and we've also prepared new projects which somehow overcome our prior uh, interest into uh, the totalitarian era, second half of 20th century, overcoming it to contemporary arts, but also modernistic art. So this is the context. This is Central Europe on a map from 1903, and now you can see how general and how broad it is, actually. And we are still dealing more with a uh, geographical area than with the concept itself, the philosophy itself, uh, and all of that. What you would like to do is build some sort of a network, and we are actually trying to do it all those years on many levels. Our last project covered uh, new media arts in Central Europe, and it's sharing, it's uh, uh, protecting, and so on. So these nets work on different levels and different contexts. But let's say this is Central Europe at the beginning of 20th century. Kind of a joke, but I quite like it. Uh, this is another structure we are entering. You are now somewhere in, uh, in the middle of this uh, part of the building. I'm not sure if you can see it. And the space next to the building is actually planned uh, for a new project, uh, the so-called Central European Forum, like the really physical space. New building which should be uh, focused on permanent collections, be working with them, uh, and so on. And for us, it's cr uh, quite in interesting, not only interesting, but also important. Everything okay? So now you can see not just the city of Olomouc, which we use quite often as a case study, uh, quite a small city somewhere in the middle of everything. Actually, you can travel wherever you want from Olomouc, but like nothing is happening here, so just a very small spot. Now you can see the cut through the building itself, which is somehow divided. And now you can see the front of the both buildings. This connection between old and new is uh, extremely important for us, so we are trying to work with it. You can see here uh, the uh, site-specific installation work by Aleš Veseli. Uh, it's still not in our collection, and actually I think we will slightly move to different directions, working more with public spaces, uh, changing this kind of uh, situation uh, in different projects, different situations, and different moments. But uh, let's say this is some sort of front part. And these are cuts through the building. I'm showing you all this, although it doesn't exist, it's still in our head uh, mostly uh, as some sort of a future imaginative project we would like to work with. You can see how monumental it is, how plain it is, but I would like to use it on more, more diverse, let's say, uh, scale. These are uh, images from inside and for also from uh, the context of public spaces because the building should be open to public on a, on a regular basis with library, with archives, with uh, spaces for projection, for site-specific installation also. What we have for now is online space. When it wasn't possible to build a building, we decided to enter online spaces. We produce quite a lot of video documents. Uh, we have online collections. We are preparing online exhibitions. It uh, works better in abroad, I would say, than at home, but it's still quite interesting for us. As I mentioned uh, before, we organized uh, an online project um, connected with CAD New Media Museum uh, last two years, as some of you know, but we are also organizing on a regular basis this kind of conferences, which op always open up the kind of topic uh, situation we are interested in currently. Last year we organized the uh, conference which was focusing on institutional cooperation and actually we are preparing quite a lot of projects 
coming from this kind of a conference. And this time uh, we are uh, interested in a conference uh, connected with the 90s. And there are two different reasons why we are interested in that uh, so very much. One is the archival uh, term, let's say again, working with archives um, also uh, in regard with a new institution, with a new collection, with a new, uh, new library, which is quite important for us, but also entering a space of contemporary history. We are started with that on local level. Uh, right now we are preparing a project for 2025 covering all the modes and Moravia and Czech Republic in the 90s and around uh, 2000 transformation period, but we would like to overlap it in future quite heavily. So this is also the reason why to invite you to work with Hermit actually, because there everything is connected somehow. And we are going back uh, to the idea, we are not going back anywhere, <laughs> we are going back <laughs> to the idea of Central European Forum as some sort of a platform, a space for meeting, for discussion, for dialogue. Uh, it will be very nice to have you on board and to meet regularly on this platform, uh, to have you as part of the institution as much as possible. Now in a very small cafe, which is not anymore working as a cafe even, but it's still the 90s space, uh, but very, uh, very quickly in a new building, hopefully. So this is it. Uh, well, let's hope we'll next meet uh, in this uh, concrete building, which is going to be irksome, but also quite horrific. <laughs> and we'll see how it's going to all work. Welcome, everyone. Thank you that you came. Really enjoyed the day and enjoy the company of others. Thank you. And now I'm uh, giving platform to Jakub and Miloš and thank them both for organizing this event. Thank you.